Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music, and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play My Ordinary Life by The Living Tombstone on the piano. Give you a preview before we start learning. It's pretty awesome, pretty catchy, and yeah, let's go. Give you a preview right now. And then you just repeat, etc. Very catchy thing, okay? The main dif uh, difficult part is the right hand because it's quite continuous. But after you master that, break it up into parts, it, it will be pretty easy to learn, okay? So let's break it up to four parts, it's easy to learn. So the first part, right hand starts with the F here, so middle C, C, R for reference. We go up an octave to this C, we go up to the F, that's where we start. So let's start learning it. So it goes F, G, A, A sharp, B, C, D. That's it for the first part, okay? Let's learn it again. So it's kind of like a scale. So F, G, A, H, R, B, C, D, like that. Okay, so like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, fingering. Okay, okay. Left hand, we have two chords. They are D minor, which is D, F, A. Okay, fully white note chord, as you can see. And then the G major is the next chord, G, B, D, which is another fully white note chord, okay? So easy to remember. Two hands together goes like this. So F and D minor together. B and G major together. It's continuous like that, so it's like together, together, like that. All right, moving on to the second part. Right hand goes back down to the E, F, G, G sharp, A, B, C. It's kind of like a sequence from the first part, okay? But just starting on the E note, so E, F, G, G sharp, A, B, C. Using the same fingering, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, okay? Left hand, we have two chords. There's C major, which is C, E, G, fully white note chord, and F major, which is F, A, C, which is another fully white note chord as well. All right, so with these two chords in mind, two hands together goes like this, E and C major together, A and F major together, like that. There you go, so together, together. Awesome. So back to back to the two parts we've learned so far, we'll be playing like this. Awesome. Moving on to the third part, right hand continues, goes D, E, F, D, B, C, D, B, like that. Okay, let's learn it again, so D, E, F, D, B, C, D, B. All right, this time the left hand chord's a bit more difficult. We have a four note chord, which is D, F, A, that's D, D, B, D, F, A, okay? And then E major, which is E, G, sharp, B. All right, so with these two chords in mind, okay? Play it a few times, get it under your fingers. Turn together goes like this, so D and B half are diminished together. B and E major together, like that. So together, together. There you go. Awesome. So back to back, the three parts of blown so far will be played like this. Moving on to the fourth and last part here, right hand goes C, B, C, D, E, D, C, A. These eight notes. C, B, C, D, E, D, C, A. Alright. Left hand we have A minor as the chord, which is A, C, E. Fully white note chord. Alright, so with that in mind, two hands together goes like this. C and A minor together. There you go. There you go. Just the first note, first chord together. Okay? So back to back, all four parts of this lesson will be played like this, and you just loop it, okay? So. Repeat. Alright, awesome. Okay, so after this, you can add your own improvisations if you want, but the chords change pretty quickly, so you can't really do that much. Okay, you can try, you can do like octave and some like arpeggios. That kind of thing, faster pages, okay? Yeah, the last chord is longer, A minor, so you can do a bit more for that one. Just go like... Yeah, but the other chords have changed pretty quickly, so you can't do that much, so you can just like... You can do like rhythmic pattern like that. Something like that. Play around with it, have fun, okay? So I hope you enjoyed this lesson, by the way. If you want to learn other catchy, awesome tunes like this, or just other The Living Tombstone awesome songs, just search up your favorite song name, followed by Amos Doll, in the YouTube search to find those other lessons to learn for yourself. But as for now, that's pretty much it. Um, and also, uh, check out my website if you want to learn more piano from me. It's bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description, if you want to learn my, from my piano courses and my other piano services, okay? But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's lesson.